After facing unnecessary criticism of people calling it creepy, Paris Jackson explained a photoshopped photo she reposted that showed her present day posing with her father, Michael Jackson, and mother, Debbie Rowe. This episode is brought to you by NHTSA, reminding us that if you're texting, you're not driving. Seriously, who thinks they have the right to say something is creepy that is obviously so sensitive and meaningful to Paris? A fan edit made by Instagram user Crafty MJ Stuff was reposted by Paris on Twitter that showed her pose as her current age with MJ and her mother. Now, upon seeing the photo, anyone who knows the history of Paris' story can see that the edit was obviously very meaningful for her, given her parental circumstances. Paris' father, Michael Jackson, died in 2009 when Paris was only 11 years old and didn't have a close relationship with her mother growing up after Debbie and Michael's divorce when Paris was very young. The photo was of course received well by true Jackson fans with one writing, I love this so much, I don't doubt he'd be so proud of you, I hope you know that. Love you lots, keep being you and don't ever change. But according to Elle magazine, one of Paris' friends referred to the photo as quote creepy AF. Paris wrote a second tweet explaining why she posted the fan edit photo saying quote, I think it's nice to dream about what it would be like to have parents and to have it put into something I can see, even if it's a fan made edit. The quote unquote friend who made the comment about the photo being creepy has since deleted their tweet following Paris' statement. A few years ago, Paris was photographed with her mother as Debbie was going through chemotherapy. Entertainment Tonight previously reported that Paris was by her mother's side the whole time, but as for the relationship now, we don't know if Paris has kept in contact with her or what the status of their closeness is, but regardless, I'm just mad that someone had the audacity to say the photo was creepy. Clearly, I'm not biased at all, but enough of what I think. Share your thoughts in the comment section below, and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching. I'm your host, Drew Dorsey, and I'll see you next time. For more, click left for all the details on Tristan Thompson caught cheating, or click right to see why people think Ariana Grande may have revealed a new song title. This episode is brought to you by NHTSA, reminding us that if you're texting, you're not driving.